This 12-year-old male presented for evaluation of a congenital scoliosis. A previous CT of the lumbar spine demonstrated hypoplasia of the posterior elements of several lower lumbar vertebra with frank dysraphism in the sacral spinal region. On MR imaging, there is a moderate leftward convex scoliosis of the lower lumbar spine. The sagittal T2-weighted images demonstrate a low-lying conus tip at the mid-L4 vertebral level. On the sagittal and axial T1-weighted images, there is a lipoma within the phylum which extends to the left in the upper sacral spinal region. There is also a combination of hypoplasia and aplasia of the posterior elements from approximately the L4 vertebral level to the mid-sacral spinal region. Spinal cord tethering can be either primary or secondary. In the primary setting, cord tethering occurs as an isolated anomaly. In the secondary setting, the tethering is associated with additional anomalies such as myelomeningocele or phylum terminale lipoma, such as in this case. Tethering is a result of discrepant growth between the vertebral column and the actual spinal cord, resulting in stretching. Syringomyelia, secondary to altered CSF dynamics, may also be seen.